Hi guys, Adam here from DarksReviews.tv in association with Darts Player TV, and it's that time again. It's my favourite bit. You're not looking behind me right now. You're not looking at all. Because it is time for the bottle soon. Guess what darts are in the box? Guess what darts are in the box? That's my new jingle that's going to be for the game. In the snakeskin beigey brownie colour ones. Let's go and see if these ones are going to be really devastating. Right, guys, here we go. Here's a closer look at the Bolson Devastators. These are from the Hammerhead range, and these are slightly different. These are the Devastators Hammerhead range. So, obviously, we've got the snakeskin box here. You've already got a dark case coming with the Bolson's thing. So, we'll open it up inside and have a look. So, we've got the Hammerhead flight. Means we get some spare stems. Means we get the little tool. And here it just says Devastators. And interesting enough, 95% tungsten, these bad boys. 23 grams obviously there's a serial number 23 ed 5r so i don't know what the five means but we've got the devastators uh hammerhead darts not toys inside a couple of little bits and bobs there and there is the darts themselves sitting in there i'm going to take one out and we shall have a closer look at it so obviously with the hammerhead range you've got the point that you can uh it moves don't panic it's not broken they do that on purpose. But obviously you've got the tool in there, so you unscrew this and you can switch the points and replace them. Dart itself, you've got the Devastator flights. We've got the uh, metal stems there. A little bit of ring grip on the rear of the stems. Nice looking ones. My, my dad used to play with those back in the day. And here at the rear, we've got black covered and the grip is very much ring grip, although slightly cut that way, so almost like a little bit of shark grip. And in the centre here in the silver bit, it's really, really fine, thin, almost like a nano micro grip in there. And then a big, deep cut out of it here for the ring, and then a small little rounded off nose to just run flush with the point as it goes in. Uh, so, boxes have just run a little right up, but it's tungsten is used in dark production because it's high weight and volume. The higher the percentage of tungsten used to make a dart, the slimmer and sleeker the dart. The Devastator line, and hence why the Devastator line, 95% because they want to make it smaller. So the dimensions for this one are 7.14 by 44.3. So it is quite a short barrel. It's slightly wide, but obviously, like I said, this is a 23 gram, hence why they've maybe made it 95% because they can make it a little bit smaller. It does come in 25 and 27 grams also. So don't need to put them together. We're going to go have a throw. See you in a sec. Right there guys, here we go, we brought the Devastators here, but time for it though, 12, let's see if we get some good scores, here we go. One hundred and forty! Start us off. Oh, hi. Oh, wild. <laughs> 41. I don't know what happened there. One hundred, one more handful of these. One hundred and forty. We're going to have a summary on this. So guys, a quick summary on the Devastators. They retail for 114 quid or just under 113 pounds and 90p or something like that. So they're just under 114 pounds. So obviously high end market, high end budget. Uh, like I say, you get your nice little presentation box, load of work going into the barrel, all sorts going on. It's a little high priced, um, but I don't like talk about prices because I'm not the one buying them. It's down to you guys. So if you want them desperately and you want to pay that money, then it's not a bad price, is it? If you don't want them and you don't want to pay that money, then it's a bad price. Uh, however you want to look at it. Um, so all in all, you get your spares, you get your accessories. They've got the, uh, the points in there which are a little crazy. I've spoken about those lots in detail, so I don't need to go into them hugely too much. But I will say, if you're interested in those sort of things, give them a try, because they actually, I quite like them. What I did, though, I helped sort of concentrate my mind. I always pulled them out before I threw I don't know if you guys noticed, because I just wanted to make sure they were fully out when I went to throw them. So that was the same every time. Just a little concentration thing, isn't it? Uh, the grip on them, obviously, it's very much focused on that central point, that sort of nano grip in there. Um, you did feel it in your hand. They've sort of come out of the hand quite nice, actually, and naturally. Um, so for that reason, I mean, it's not a crazy, insane, like, hard grip. 
and it's obviously not smooth grip. So I'm going to go bang in the middle on 2.5 on neck up. If you've got a set and you don't agree with a word of that, please, please, please tell me. I love to hear from you. So leave your reviews at www.dartsreviews.tv. Bear that. To, uh, you can download the app. And then when you've done that, subscribe channel, turn notifications on, leave a little like, leave a comment saying, Adam, you funny, crazy guy. And I'll see you again soon. Cheers.